Want to learn how to put your makeup on in three to five minutes and eight easy steps? I'm going to show you how. If you've never heard of my service marked Cute and Carpool, well now you have. This is my no makeup makeup look. You need zero artistic ability and this look will leave you looking polished and awake and not like you tried. So eyebrows are not a part of Cute and Carpool. If you have good brows, skip it. It's not a mandatory step. If you look like a hairless cat like myself, you can draw them on. So my brows are on. Ready? Now time for step one. Step one is the tinted primer. This is three products in one. It is sunscreen, primer, and a very sheer foundation. The Cute and Carpool is not about using everything in your makeup bag all at once. It's what can I do quickly to get out of the house in three to five minutes? When applying the tinted primer, you want to put this all over your entire face, stopping at your jawline, except for the eye socket area. Never put foundations or concealers on the eyelid as it will crease throughout the day. Step two is under eye concealer. You don't want to look like you just rolled out of bed and rolled into the carpool line. Get bright under your eyes. If you've seen any of my other videos, you know about my under eye hammock. This is how you create a very rested look like you don't have any children and you got eight to 10 hours of sleep last night. You go up against the nose, out towards the end of the eyebrow, and then press it in with your fingers to make it look more believable like skin. Do you see why this is one of the mandatory eight steps you never leave the house without? Look at the difference underneath my eyes, huge. Step three is face powder. You wanna make sure you set your makeup with a powder so it doesn't come off on your child's clothing as you hug them off to school. We have two versions of face powder. We have our mattifying oil blot powder, which is translucent. It looks really white, but it's clear. Or we have our true silk powder, which is what I'm wearing. I'm a little bit pink in the cheeks, so I like this one for extra coverage. If you notice, I started by applying in a patting motion. That way you don't wipe off the tinted primer. Then you go back and you buff to blend. Now to the halfway point, bronzer. See how fast this is moving? Now, if you look at my arms and you look at my face, and if you could see my chest, they're all the same color, but I have severe white neck syndrome. By applying bronzer to my neck, I'm tying everything together from my face to my chest. When something is lighter and brighter, it looks like it's coming forward and nobody wants this coming forward. Next, I put the bronzer on and below the cheekbone and up into the temple for blending. You can see how that gave me a little bit of a lift and it gave me more dimension to my face. And as you can see, I did not apply blush. I don't feel like blush is a mandatory product in the eight steps. I think bronzer is more important because it ties everything together and you can see. Next up is lip gloss. My favorite color for Cute and Carpool is Thanks a Latte because it's the perfect enhancement to a natural lip tone without glitter or frost. So on the days that you don't have time to put on lipstick, liner, and gloss, look how pretty that is. You see my lips, but they're not lips coming first. The last three steps of Cute and Carpool are the eyes. Step one, brow lift. This only comes in one shade. This is the product that you carve underneath the outer two thirds of the eyebrow. If you have any little hairs growing in that need to be tweezed, it creates a really clean look and it opens up your eyes so you look lifted, brighter, and awake. You only need a smidge of this product as one container should last you two years if you were to use it every single day. Step number seven is eye base natural. If you're like me and have very thin lids or you use an eyelash growth serum, you're probably gonna be a little bit red and you can see the veins. When you apply this, product all the way across the lid through the crease tap with your fingers it gives your eyes a really awake look without any redness instantly taking the tired out of your eyes you're gonna be using the same brush to apply both brow lift and eye base just make sure you wipe it off in between and step number eight is mascara if you have very straight lashes you can curl your lashes first if not go straight to the mascara for cute and carpal I recommend our infinity length mascara because it's very natural it's not a thickening mascara it's just a nice natural lengthening mascara but look how much better my eyes look with the mascara. I look so much more lifted, especially since I curled first. So if you're a mom on the go and you're looking for something quick and easy and you never take time for personal hygiene, Cute and Carpool is for you. Now, if you don't have children and maybe you're an attorney, you can call it Cute in the Courtroom. If you're a doctor, you can call it Cute in the Clinic. Whatever you want to call it, it's such a great way to make no excuses in the morning to look polished and awake and so you can look and do your best.